Hey everyone, Keith Murray here, Hockey Director at HOC. Welcome to Talk at Hockey. I hope everyone's staying safe and staying active this summer. Today, with Sam, we're going to talk about and demonstrate the backhand wrist shot and backhand snapshot. Let's start with the backhand wrist shot. On the heel of the stick, off your back foot or your far foot, your hand should be comfortably on, on the shaft of your stick, but not too far apart. Lots of lots of young players make the mistake of having their hands too far apart. If they're a little closer together, you get more whip action out of your stick. So again, puck on the heel of the stick, off your far foot or your back foot, and as you pull with both hands to bring the puck across your body, forcefully, you roll the puck from the heel of your stick toward the middle of the stick, or the middle of the blade, firing it at your target and ultimately pointing at your target. So if you want it to be a, a high backhand, you aim high, a low backhand, aim low, similarly with the corners of the net, aiming where you want the puck to go. So again, backhand wrist shot, puck starts in the heel, on your far foot or your back foot, hands are not too far apart, hands are away from the body, bring the puck across the body with both hands and let's look at the backhand snapshot. A little bit different this, this time the puck actually starts at the pull of the blade and with a little bit of a toe drag you bring the puck back to the middle of the blade and at the same time you are pushing with your top hand and pulling with your bottom hand making a snapping action as you snap the puck towards the target. Both of these shots require a lot of practice to get good at them. Goalies though are not comfortable seeing backhands because they don't see all that many. So I would suggest you practice your backhand, your wrist shot and the backhand snapshot as much as you can. You may surprise yourself. You may see the puck ending up in the back of the net more often than, than previously. If you're unsure about the success of the backhand, check out videos by number 87 in Pittsburgh. He is a master with the backhand. That's it for Talking Hockey this week. Take care, stay safe, and see you next time.